Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So over the last couple of months, I've been posting regarding the marker effect. That is a feature that Microsoft cannot really make up their mind about in the Edge browser, where your marker effect appears in your title bar at the top and takes on and carries the same opaque dynamic effect as the background wallpaper to some extent or the other. Now, in October, around the middle of October this year, I posted a video that Microsoft had brought back the experimental flag that enables the marker effect in Edge Canary, which back then was version 120. And earlier today, as I posted, version 120 of the Edge browser has now made its way to the stable version. And I'll leave that video down below. So just to let you know that surprisingly, Microsoft now has reintroduced the flag to enable the marker effect once again in the stable version so this as mentioned is a feature that does come and go a little bit but seems for now to be available once again in edge stable 120 now as always um, to enable the marker effect we head up to the address bar and we enter edge colon forward slash forward slash flags hit enter and this will take you to the experimental flags page now the easiest is just to enter marker and there we go and this is the flag we are looking for. Show Windows 11 visual effects in the title bar and toolbar. And the flag is actually called Edge Visual Rejuve Marker. So as always, we change that from default to enabled. And then we'll have to restart to apply that flag to enable the marker effect. And now you'll see that if we head back, and I always say the marker effect can be seen a lot better if you turn on a light theme, it can be seen in dark, but nonetheless can be seen in light. And we change this from um, system default, which currently is dark, to light. Now, just to take note, while we are on the appearance page, what that flag will do is it will add this setting. Show Windows 11 visual effects in the title bar and toolbar. And it says adds marker effect to the title bar and toolbar backgrounds when using the default theme. This functionality depends on your device and Windows settings. Take note, we are still working on this feature, so you may experience some performance issues, and Microsoft seems to be working on this feature for quite some time now. But once again, the flag is back for now, and as I've mentioned with flags, they are not options, they are experiments, so this flag can be removed once again by Microsoft, so just take note of that. Now, something else, uh, if this is off, just toggle it on, and then you'll have to restart uh, your browser, because without that turned on, that, that setting, this will not work. Now you can see that if we head back and we just kind of minimize that a little bit, you can see, and I've chosen a nice bright wallpaper, you can see now that when I move that browser around, the title bar here at the top takes on that opaque effect from the background wallpaper. So there you can see it's more of an orange, a brown. It goes more to like a dark gray. There we can see blue. I don't know if you can actually see that correctly in the video there. It's picking up a bit of that purple. There we go, you get the general idea. So as I move that around, that marker, that opaque dynamic material from the background now is being displayed in the title bar. So for those of you who enjoy the marker effect, just letting you know, as mentioned, it's now back in Edge 120. And um, But for now, as mentioned, it's available, but could once again be removed by Microsoft. So I'll keep you posted though if anything changes. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.